Crafting for Weeks, and today I'm going to show you how to tie the sailor's knot for the crossed pair headband. So you're going to start with these two strips. Um, you can see that they are slightly thicker on the edges because there's an extra row of half double crochets there. And we are going to lay them out one strip at a time. Um, it doesn't really matter which uh, direction the half double crochets are facing at this point because we will fix that later. So you're going to start by crossing this one one over the other and that's all we're going to do with this one for now. We're going to work with the other one first. So you're going to cross that right below where you cross the others. And you're just going to lay it on top. You're going to take one side, put it under both of the uh, edges of that loop. Take the other side and weave it under, over, and out of the um, opposite side of the loop. Okay, now we're ready to work with the other piece. So you're going to pull this completely out. So you're going to take it and weave it under and out of the opposite side of the loop. Now you're just going to gently tighten it. And uh, you want to try to do this as evenly as possible, but um, once you get it tightened, you can see that um, these edges will kind of lift and curl if it's too tight, but you can uh, loosen it slightly. So now on this side you can see the half double crochets line up, which is perfect. But on this side you can see they're backwards. So I'm going to show you how to flip them. You just want to Take one side and gently rotate it and then work your way through the knot and gently rotate it over so that they're flipped on both sides. And then your half double crochets will line up on the inside on the opposite side. And that is where you're going to do your slip stitches across. So there you have the sailor's knot for the cross pair headband. For the pattern, I will go ahead and put the link in the comments and you can learn how to make your own at craftingforweeks.com.